want to welcome Knox as part of our first speaker and our panel today. Wow, thank you so much, Nolin. And I'm so excited to be here to share the platform with all these experts. I'm excited also meeting everybody. I see everyone is just connecting from all over South Africa and even Namibia, neighboring countries. Really exciting to, to do this with all of you. And this is something I'm very passionate about. As Nolene said, I changed careers from a science background, biochemistry and microbiology to marketing. And when I did that um, through corporate, I realized how important it is that you own your truth and you're able to actually tell your story to everybody that you work with and everyone that you connect with. So this is something that we're very passionate about. But also, um, as you go through all the other speakers and you listen to other experts, it'll actually make sense to you to see that you need to have that confidence of who you are um, and a sure footing every time you show up in this world. Before you build anything, before you even command or sell something or begin to serve a community, you want to have a strong sense of self. And that's where you regain your power and you show up in that powerful state of being. So there's some lies, obviously, and, and things that we've, we've heard and they've been shared about um, when it comes to personal branding, one thing is that as soon as you create a logo, like the logos that are behind me, you've got a brand. That's not a brand. And, um, and, and a lot of people think it's something you do once. But if you understand what branding is, it's about brand narration. It's about a story that you tell those that may be interested and those that may resonate with your story. And in that way, you get to serve them. And in serving them, you may actually get a living or, or be able to drive business growth. So it's something that is a continuous journey. Um, as long as you live, you are actually a brand that is constantly communicating. Now, the question is, do you have good control of your story in this world or you've allowed other people to shape you and also to tell your story um, on your behalf? It's not about publicity also, even though publicity is part of you profiling your brand. And it's not only for extroverts. It even works better when you are an introvert because your brand tends to speak for you even before you open your mouth and people get to see things that you're doing out there and they can actually get a sense of who you are. And there's obviously this worry about those who are employed to say, why would I build my brand and I'm employed? But really, personal branding is about you coming to your own. It's not going to clash with a corporate company or whoever you work for or you work with. And it's not for celebrities only, even though when I share some example of personal brands globally and in South Africa, you obviously might think, OK, this is just celebrity stand. No, it's not. And the most important thing is to know that you always have to integrate what you share online with who you truly are in real life. So there's no separation of I'm going to just put a facade online and that's not my true self. And then there's a totally separate person or different person when I meet you in person. It's um, if you think it's exhausting as well. It's something you got to think about. If you think breathing is exhausting, if you think living is exhausting, then, you know, for me, I'm a, you might as well just share your story if you are in this world. And there's time if you make time for it and you know why it's important. And so this is something that I say it's it's a it's a journey and a process where you get to know who you are and you show up unapologetically and you show up intentionally in everything that you do, career, business, community service and whatever that you do. So I actually refer to personal branding as a self-discovery journey, something that actually allows you to get to know yourself well, um, something that is also a key to unlock your success in life. And if you've never taken that journey of self-discovery, while we are here, please visit my website, bloominsideout.co.za, and I can share a free discovery, self-discovery template with you that you can actually then begin to journey through the knowing of who you are. What's in it for you? You ask yourself, like, why would I bother really do all this work of building my brand and telling people my story? I think the most important thing in life is, is exactly that, owning your life. It is a skill that you need for both personal and business growth, as well as success. So it's one thing that you will need to boost your confidence because really, if you know who you are, you're not going to be swayed around by, you know, circumstances, people that are trying to press your buttons. You, you show up solid and you know who you are. You are very well anchored and grounded. It also helps you attract opportunities because as we say, branding is the pull it's what pulls people to you the people that you want to do business with the people you want to grow with you want to collaborate with and it also gives you that power to be the one that steers your life so you become your own leader with what i call self-leadership and that way you are able to then navigate your and set your destiny 
creating the dream life that you always wanted to live. And if you're South African, even obviously not South African, you definitely know this girl. She's from the same township here where I was born in, in Durban, in KZN. So the world knows her, but how did she start building her brand? It, it's she pursued her passion. She wanted to pursue acting while she was at varsity in Cape Town. She went and auditioned. The story then, if you want to read it online, it's there. Eventually she was almost like a mouthpiece of KZN Durban to the world in terms of selling what is beautiful about Durban. And she did this, this at Essence Festival in America. Before you know, every brand was hooking her on in terms of be the representative, be the brand ambassador from Audi, Neutrogena, Forbes, Africa, Verve, Kokyo, everybody. And now you've seen her in Coming to America and she's now a global star in terms of acting. And she is a girl from the township right around the corner here. She just said yes to her passion, yes to her pursuits, and, um, and she just carried on developing herself. The most important thing, again, in terms of why should you do it, it will unleash your own inner power. You know, Nolene, when she introduced uh, myself, she said that I'm always fascinated about unlocking the power of women particularly. And this is the only way we can even have a shot when it comes to gender equality, is that as women, we rise up to that leadership, core leadership role in life where we know what our, our role, our mission and what we want to do in this world. And it's not something you're going to be given. You don't get given the power. You claim your power back by doing exactly this exercise of building your brand, owning your truth, and then sharing your story in everything that you do. So you get to stand out because honestly, you are unique in everything that you do. The way you speak, your personality. We may all be in marketing in this masterclass with all the speakers. We just don't do it the same. And then there are people that will resonate with me and they might not resonate with another marketeer. So don't hold back because you think, ah, oh, well, other people are doing it already. Do it your way. Do it the way as unique as you are. It's also a way of reinventing yourself like I did. As a scientist, I eventually have now owned a marketing agency. I'm coaching other women and businesses to drive their growth um, in terms of branding and, 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 and really have a shot at their success. So you can reposition yourself set yourself apart and create a legacy with yourself. I don't have to speak through all of these. I know exactly you know them, all of them. And these are brands that are very prominent globally, locally, and they are out there just living their best life and uh, showing up as their true self in a way that is authentic, in a way that amplifies their talents and what God gave them as gifts. So the starting point in getting to know yourself is really know the big purpose behind your life. And I always say you, you, the only person you can ask is the one that created you. If you want to know why you were created, ask God. If you want to know why he gave you those specific um, gifts and talents, ask him. And you can then show up knowing you are qualified by those gifts and talents and the purpose that you have in your life. So my belief is that everybody has a shot at being successful. And I call that born to bloom. You are born to flourish as a seed that has got such potential and such greatness. And so it's important that you understand you're here to show off that purpose, to serve the world with all that you are. You're here to be significant. You're here to be successful, to prosper and continue to grow and multiply in everything that you do. You are born to make a dent in this world and make this world a better place. And if this fascinates you and you want to read more about it, I have an ebook also on my website, bloominsideout.co.za. You can just download it. It's a, it's a PDF and it's such an easy one to read. Quick read, but it really affirms and confirms that indeed you have a reason to be here and everything that you want to create, everything you are inspired to be, you can do it. And we are all waiting to see what you've got. So that's one way of unlocking your power. So what you put in when you build your brand, your dreams, your expertise, shape your thoughts and your mindset, make the choices that propel you forward, know your purpose and let that be the one thing that makes you commit to getting up every single day and then stay focused and persevere despite what's going on around you. So I won't obviously delve into this, but these are the three things that I almost say you need to always be connected because there's no silos in this success journey you want to be with others look at us collaborating as six experts in marketing in different areas so learn to connect with god the source of your power your gifts and your excellence learn to connect with who you are and yourself your true authenticity and learn to connect with others in that is the success 
and the key that unlocks your prosperity. So the three quick P's to building your brand is asking yourself, what is my story? And I'm asking you today, what is your story? What do you want to be known for? What is it that you want this world to remember you for? What is the mission? The thing that really keeps you up at night and you say, I want to make sure personally that every woman finds their power and shows up in their power and they rise to that core leadership role with everyone in this world. So three things, if you take anything from this talk today is package your gifts, package your qualities, package your expertise, all that basically you command that you've already mastered and you excel in it, um, package that and then Positioning it is something that will be quite at length. So tomorrow I have a, um, a blooming business bootcamp. It's also on my socials at Knox Bloom on all the social media spaces. You can join us tomorrow at 12, where I talk about the positioning strategy of how you own that space in everyone's mind every time your name is mentioned. And then every day, everything you share on social media, it's about profiling yourself. Every time you connect, like we are connecting here today, it's about profiling yourself tell your story to everybody so i won't go into the details of what you package because i've already given that to you it's all about what you have within you already and in building your brand remember that you need consistency like coca-cola remains that red and white packaging and it's a black fizzy drink within with sugar and all it never changes its color so really think about the colors think about the tone think about your fonts think about the entire packaging of you how you want to show up so the purple and blooming inside is all about remembering that we are all royalty so for me the boldness of that purple there's a science behind every color in what you do right so it's very important that you then think about those things in what you do positioning is something that is it can take longer it takes another hour to do but quickly to understand what it is, it is that when people think of you, what is that mental space that distinctly says this is Nolene, distinctly says this is Knox, Knox is good at this, Knox excels in this. If you're looking for someone to speak to you about branding, if you look for somebody who builds your brand, then speak to Knox. What is it that you want to be known for? So I'm going to skip it because I've got 20 minutes. And if you want to hear more about this section, then join me tomorrow for the Bloom Business Bootcamp. And it's all the way we're going to delve into who your target audience is. What are the insights and the problems you're trying to solve? What sets you apart and differentiates you? And what will be that essence out there for you to engage with everybody? So what is it that you stand for? And, and when you know that, then you can launch your story, you can profile your story, you can build your personal brand online using exactly that, that consistency of what your story is. So take time to do that. Take time to be your own brand. Communicate your service, your mission to the target community that you're here to serve with a clear image and a story that is ongoing. And obviously, we want to see it's a visual era. Have a photo shoot that really portrays you in your strength, that portrays you in the best um, self that you can be, that makes the next person say, I definitely want to connect with this person, right? And know that even if you don't have the budget for a branding agency like my Blue Marketing Agency, you can be your own PR guru, phone a radio station, community radio station, tell them you've got a story to inspire others, tell them how you've turned your your problems to a profitable business. Tell them how you've turned around your mistakes into a mission that can help others get out of the same um, fix in life. So personal branding is part of your growth strategy. It's part of your communication plan. It's what you do every day is researching who else needs what I have to offer, who else need what I've now mastered. And then you share the, that with everyone, publishing it in a book, publishing it in your social media stories, in video content, in YouTube, in different spaces. And now this digital revolution allows us to really publish, curate, collaborate, and broadcast our narrative to everybody in the world with such ease. So one thing to remember as I wrap up, this is an infinite journey. You never stop blooming. You never stop blooming. As long as you're breathing, you are flourishing. So there's no arrival. And if you fail, know that you can try again the next day. Be in the know. Stay connected. 
you being here today shows me that you're fascinated about growth and you want to know, you want to discover things, you want to learn things. So it is about defining your vision, building your credibility in this world, being authentic and really take ownership. Own your power in everything that you do. The, the, the worst thing you can do is allow people to tell your story and they might just represent you in a wrong way. So own your narrative and be the one that tells people who you are. So thank you so much for everybody here. Please do tag, share, screen grab my presentation here and uh, tag me and give me feedback on social media at Knox Bloom on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook and LinkedIn. And if you want to journey with me on unlocking your power and potential to prosper, you can join me for a one-on-one -on -one coaching session, six hour sessions that are split over 12 weeks, going at your own pace, usually goes at 5,400 per person. But because you're here today, I'm gonna knock off a thousand rand and you can have this at four and a half thousand rand. And really all you have to do is drop me a message at bloominsideout.co and .za. So, so fascinated to be here with all of you. Nolene, I think I nailed my 20 minutes. I'm done. Thank you so much for the platform. Oh, <laughs>